Hey guys, welcome back to another Vlogmas. It is Sunday today and um, it's a bit of a chill day. It's currently 11.40 and I've been up for a couple hours. I was up until 1 a.m. last night. We did go to our family's house and we played board games with a couple of friends that they had over and stuff. Like our, basically our circle. So that was a lot of fun. A fun little game that's like from the 80s, I think. And then we came home and I ended up staying up a little bit later than I wanted to. So Michael's still sleeping. I have just been in the living room by myself, which is honestly quite nice. I'm used to getting up, watching some videos. I just wanted to do a little hair update too. So the hair is, you know, I feel like it's a bit long. I feel like to my nose would have been good. Um, even when it's curly, I did stretch the curl out and it was like down to here. So we shall see, I might end up cutting them. <laughs> I don't know though. Oh, I also washed my hair that night after I filmed me cutting my hair because I just really needed to wash it. I put a little bit of product in it and I tried curling my hair and it just didn't take. So it's just this like very um, poofy because it was very foggy yesterday. I think it was just very humid out. I do want to go to the beauty supply store and get a roller and see how that works. I've never used a roller before. Um, I basically woke up and was on YouTube again, um, looking at little short clips of the Korean people and the rollers and all that. Like, I think I have to style them a different way. I think I have to like blow dry them and set them in a roller. I can't just straighten them or else it does, it just doesn't set correctly. You know, I tried. Wow, the sun is really washing me out. I do want to share some like nice uh, routines that I have with you guys today, so I think I'll do that later. We have Shmivai underneath. You have a nice little sun patch coming through. And then we have Kiyomi over there. <laughs> this little area. later on sorry about the dryer we are having some coffee this is my second cup I got the um, Swiss Miss peppermint mocha and dark chocolate so I've been making little peppermint mochas and Michael's going to have some I'm gonna try it yeah we just have to get a little bit of them um, well he's putting where's our stirs It's not very sweet. I need more. Where'd my marshmallows go? <laughs> they all disappeared. <laughs> all, all that means is more marshmallows. Okay. Yeah, mine are still in there. My marshmallows were weak. This is like. Or a, I ate them, I just don't. <laughs> yeah, you probably did. While you were tasting it, it wasn't um, sweet enough. Yeah, it's a big one. You too. just need whipped cream. I know there's a lot of background noise, but it's fine. Um, I'm trying to go through our coat closet and take out like all of our hats and shoes and things you don't wear. I'm trying to consolidate. I'm also trying to sell stuff on Mercari, which has been working out. Um, so that's all I'm doing. It's unfortunate because this is the only place our vacuum can go. So it takes up a lot of room like on the ground, but whatever. This is like the one task that I am taking on as far as organization. I also have sheets in the wash, so that's what that noise is. So, so I'm currently outside. I'm actually spraying my new boots with some of this stuff, the Kiwi boot water repellent, and I was scared that it would change the color of my boots, but it didn't. So I'm doing a second coat, and I'm gonna show you guys what it looks like. So this one isn't sprayed, and this is a natural color, quite nice and light, and then this is it after it's sprayed and it is darker and I was scared it would stay like that, but it did go back down. So yeah, I'm just gonna give this another coat and I can finally wear them. I'm in the middle of making dinner right now and I didn't know what I was going to do. We had steak laying out and apparently it's a tougher cut, which I didn't know. So I sliced it up thinly and I have it marinating in some sauce. I'm going to make like a 
lo mein type noodle dish, but it's not really lo mein. Um, I'm hoping that the meat comes out kind of soft. We shall see. I sliced it very thin. So I'm boiling the water and I'm using buckwheat noodles, which I haven't used in a while. And I just have zucchini and a red bell pepper. I'm gonna throw in some of these and just keeping them in the freezer for now, and that's about it. Here is the completed food with veg. So it's the evening and I'm going to do a nice little relaxing evening for myself, a little spa moment in the bathroom. So I normally do this every single week, which is my face mask and it's the Nourished 3-1, the one that I shared in my winter skincare routine. So this is the only mask that I've been using and I like it because it's really quick. So I'm going to do that while the bath is filling up hopefully it fills up pretty fast um this is only a three minute mask so i got these dr teal's bath bombs they're pink himalayan and i got these because i didn't realize that i already had some epsom salts so i think i'm just gonna do the epsom salt and use that up before i do one of these i also got some sake I like to like drink something in the bath. This is so strong, but you'll need a small amount. It's also like not very good. So I have that, I also have water. So I'm gonna start with my face mask, turn the water on and get this started. I'm very excited. show you guys my body care routine um there's not much to it not gonna lie uh, first thing i do when i get out of the shower is spray some of this in my body this is the paula's choice acne body spray because as far as my chest goes it's pretty good um, my back on the other hand does react to sugar i'm pretty sure like it's been good but it is struggling a little bit. I think it's because of all the baking and stuff. So this is one thing that I always spray. It does have a weird smell. Since I did the mask, I don't do too much stuff on my skin. So I'm just going to stick to some hyaluronic acid and the Dream Mask by Youth to the, Pe Youth to the People. Oh my gosh. I'm trying to whisper because I'm not sure if Michael has his headphones in and I always feel weird like talking to the camera when I'm by myself so that's why I'm being weird right now. As far as lotion goes, I have two lotions. The first one, oh my god. I almost hit myself in the eye. This is the Slow Lotion from European Wax Center and I use this on my legs mainly. And then for the rest of my body, I have this 7 cent, oh my God, 7th Sense CBD Moisture Rich Body Cream. And I've had this for a year. I got this right before Christmas last year and I still have it. Um, I'm almost to the end. It's hemp patchouli scented. I'm not really sure if it works, but you know. It smells really good. I love the smell of patchouli. To seal everything in, it's basically like doing a mask. I've been putting on the V Healing White Mint and this has petrolatum in it, but it also has ceramides. So this is basically slugging. And I've known about this for a very long time, like since I was a kid, because my mom actually would put on lotion and then put on Vaseline afterwards. And first of all, I hate Vaseline. Like. I don't like the feeling of it, and this does feel like it, but I honestly just deal with it. So I put this on mainly on my legs and my arms, but I think since I did the whole salt bath situation, I will put this on most of my body because my skin does feel a bit tight. I'm just hoping this will help out a bit more. For deodorant, I use Old Spice. 
and I do want to get a different one. I did go on like a natural deodorant journey. I think I got this last year or two years ago. I can't really remember. But um, I have hyperhidrosis. I've never talked about it. And it's actually very easy to get diagnosed. You basically talk to your doctor and they're like, yeah, you have hyperhidrosis. I've gotten prescription deodorant and I do that when I go on vacation, like to hot places. But yeah, I just don't bother with natural deodorant because it's really like an anxious thing for me. I don't even know, like it's something I can't control. And I just don't want to worry about being really sweaty when I'm out in public because it just happens and then it just is a big mental health game to me and I would just rather use this. That's all for that little chat. Got a little deep there. One thing that's very funny is um, I always forget to brush my hair when it's straight because since I have curly hair, I forget that straight hair can be brushed. <laughs> um, I don't live this life. It is very fun when I get to do this because um, it's very satisfying. Like when I wash my hair in the shower when it's curly and I get to detangle it, it is so satisfying. I'm very excited to wash my hair because it's very frizzy right now. I am a puffball. It's time to make some tea. This is another one of my nightly rituals. I love having tea now. It's my thing. I'm gonna do this one tonight. It's been a while. Decaf, of course. Kiyomi is so excited right now because the gray blanket is on the bed. He's obsessed. He will find this blanket like wherever it is and like lay on it. So my hair is up and I have my tea here. I haven't even tasted it. Um, I haven't made this in a long time. It's like the moon milk. It's always so good. Put a little bit of brown sugar in there. And I also have my cookies. I have lotus cookies. I have this little pack. I'm gonna eat this now, and if I want something like salty, I did bring my harvest peas because they're so good. And Caesar, <sighs> Caesar is so good, or like garlic parmesan. I just go to Target and I see them on sale, and then I buy like six of them. I got two more the other day. <laughs> so that's it. I'm going to go and watch my video, enjoy my tea, enjoy my snacks. Thank you guys for watching. I hope you're having a magical day. If you enjoyed the video, please give it a like, thumbs up, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye.